time for us to go into the photo link library for our customary Friday visit. Mike Stevens says in the library, things are most certainly looking up. There's some things in this world you can pretty much count on. Brad Diefenbacher offers this Falls on Saturday Run in Bradford County. I'd take that as one. Another comes from Sandra Wall in Dalton. Clear skies, plenty of sun, a lovely day. Of course, some days nature plays tricks. Starts with a nice day like this one, captured by Vicki Buck in South Renovo, but changes before long. A storm blows in, does what it wants, then moves on, and Vicki was there to see that as well. Almost as payback for its troublesome ways, nature offers skies worthy of a second look. Here, a sunrise from Michelle Mark Aurel in Easton. Perhaps a threat of another confrontation, just to spice things up. This from Diane Beckett of Stallstown. One more bordering on the edge from Jennifer Foster in Elysburg. Still, the clouds are well worth a second look. A new day brings with it new giant pieces of sculpture moving above us. From Jimmy Saleo at Havenstreit's Farms, Moscow. Another comes to us from Claire Huber and Mildred. If you were in Oval on a morning such as this, you would have found the sun ready to rise over Lycoming County, as Mary Lakowski did. The fog would fade soon. Somewhere else, a sunset made interesting. It was captured by Cindy Purcell in Danville. A few clouds to add to emphasis to the moon and stars from Michelle Mark Aurel in Easton. No matter the time of day, the clouds generally can be found floating along, making for memorable works of art, like this from John D. in Tunkhannock. The changing sky allows us to see a different world, something new. As with this image from Tom in Wilkesbury Township, it's a place hard to pass by. I'm Mike Stevens in the PhotoLink Library.